everyone, how are you? And today we're going to talk about a relative pronoun who. Like we're going to see some sentences like he's the one who is doing something. Okay? So who? Normally who you be yours kim on like an ambush soul can say like who is this? Who the king? Like, who gave you this money? Who put it on the king? What is it who you feel zamir or a concha? Yani shu kishi ki shu shu shu yapan anon ver kan jumneye or the who bir is it is zamir gurebi goje o kishi thinks it that. Okay. So you will see examples and understand what I mean much better. Okay, here on the board you will see four dialogues. Okay, person one, person two, and person one again. Yeah, and with the third time dialogue goes, with the who, where they, who where they, on that side, who they bust you soon, and shu shu shu shu ya pan shaking that. Okay, for example, where is Ted? Oh. Ted who? Ah, oh, Ted is the one who will teach us this program today. Yani, I mean, your key. Ted nerede? I believe it's your. Ted Kim. Oh, look at ha. Ah, Ted, şu bize bu programı bugün öğretecek olan kişi. Okay, kişilerde böyle who zamiriyle o kişiyi tanımlayabiliyoruz. Ted is the one, Ted o kişidir, o kişi ki who will teach us this program today. Hep burada hep aynı kalıbı göreceğiz. The one who will do this, the one who is doing that. Okay, the second example. Have you seen John? Which John are you talking about? I'm talking about the one who is taking the same elective course as we are. Hmm, okay. Bakalım. Have you seen John? John gördün mü? Which John are you talking about? Hangi John'dan bahsediyorsun? Ah, bahsettiğim hangisi? The one who is taking the same elective course as we are. Bizimle aynı seçmeli dersi alan can yok mu? İşte ondan. The one who is taking. Bizimle aynı dersi, seçmeli dersi alan can. And the third dialogue. Have you seen Elif? Elif who? Uh, she is the one who was in the science lab with us yesterday. Ah, yine Elif'i gördün mü? Have you seen Elif? Elif who? Hangi Elif? Elif kim? She's the one. Huh? Okay, she's the one who was in the science lab with us. Bizimle dün bilim yani fen laboratuvarında bizimle birlikte olan Elif. She's the one who was in the science lab with us yesterday. And the fourth dialogue and the longest one here. Let's have a look. Sen burada bir Annesiyle babasıyla konuşuyor buradaki bir öğrenci. I love all my teachers, especially Mrs. Collins. And the mother says, do I know her? And the kid says, maybe you do. She's the one who came from Doğa Koleji last semester or last term. Okay, ne diyor burada? Çocuk diyor ki, bütün öğren, bütün öğretmenlerimi çok seviyorum. Özellikle Bayan Collins'i. Ve annesi diyor ki, hmm, do I know her? Tanıyor muyum? Onu tanıyor muyum? And the kid says, çocuk diyor ki, belki de tanıyorsun. Maybe you do. Ve ondan sonra tanıtıyor hangisi olduğunu. She is the one. Or she is a teacher or a man. How do say who came from Doğa Koleji last term? Geçen dönem Doğa Koleji'nden gelen. Okay, so we are going to see four pictures and four more examples related to the pictures now. Okay, here are the pictures and start from the first one here. Okay, in this picture, I hope you see it clearly. And there are like one, two, three, four, five, six. There are six friends in this picture and they are wearing different costumes. And we're going to ask 
about Timmy. You see, Timmy is here. All right. So if I ask you like this, which one is Timmy here? Timmy bunaran hangisi. Which one is Timmy? You see, Timmy'nin bir şapkası var. Şapka giyiyor. O zaman bunu nasıl kamanda ediyoruz? How we? Okay, I'm gonna ask you. How you can complete the sentence? He is the one who is. Okay, try to do it yourselves. Yani Timi, o şapkalı olan, şapka giyiyor olan BJ's değil mi? So let's do it. He is the one who is wearing a hat. Yes. Timmy is the one who is wearing a hat. Timmy, şu şapka giyiyor olan. Okay. What about this picture? Okay. In this picture, you see two girls. Okay. Two young girls. They are both wearing sunglasses. And they are in a, you know, department store or a supermarket. And... This girl is actually pushing her friend who is in a shopping cart. Okay, so this girl is Pamela. So we're going to ask about Pamela. So which one is Pamela? Just keep Pamela şu alışveriş arabasının içinde olan. Just try to think and try to do yourself. Hmm. Okay, she is the one who is going in the shopping cart. Yes, Pamela is it? Pamela is the one who is going in the shopping mall, the shopping cart, and Alishvish or was on each day giden Pamela. Oh, she is the one who is going in the shopping cart. And here is a third picture, and in this picture you see two men, two guys, okay? So, one of them is here just squatting, and the other one is standing up. So, I'm gonna ask you about Larry. So, which one is Larry? Larry So, he is the one who is... Ayakta duruyor olan. He is the one who is, yes. Yes, he is the one who is standing. Because this one, I don't know his name actually, but he is squatting, he is below his friend. And Larry is standing above him. So Larry is the one who is standing. Okay, and the last picture. And one, two, three. There are three friends here, and all of whom are girls. So you see, three girls, and one of them is Shayda. So which one is Shayda? This one. But how would you define her? So you will make a sentence that would mean, uh, Shayda should Gunesh goes to Tokyo Oba. So let's think about it. How would you make a sentence? She is the one who is. Yes! Who is wearing sunglasses? Yes! Shayda is the one who is wearing sunglasses. Shayda, Gunesh goes to Tokyo Olam. Okay, so this is how we use this who, this relative pronoun, and how we make this kind of sentences. Now I'm going to give you some homework from your course book and workbook. Let's see our student book first. Hand in hand, sick student book. And unit 8 at the library. Okay, sayfa 54'ten başlıyor. 54'te burada diyalogları okuyacağız ve anlamlarına bakacağız. Ardından buradaki After School adlı şarkıyı da dinleyebilirsiniz. Ondan sonra burada e, 
doğru e, phrase'leri burada doğru yerleri diyalog içerisinde doğru yere yerleştireceğiz. Ardından sayfa 56'da burada az önce anlattığım which one is Mary, which one is Ted, Ted is the one who is az önce kullandığımız kalıpları burada buradaki arkadaşlarımızla ilgili cümleler kuracağız işte Mary şunu şunu yapan, Jason da şunu şunu yapan ve aynı şekilde burada da benzer bir çalışma var bunları dolduracağız yukarıdaki resimlere göre sayfa 57'de ve ardından sayfa 58'de Library of Celsius ve bir vocabulary ve reading çalışması var gördüğünüz gibi doğru kelimeleri burada parça içine yerleştireceğiz ve ondan sonra listening çalışmaları var buradan listening'e göre şeyleri bulacaksınız doğru resimleri bulacaksınız ve ardından metric system of measurements ve buradaki e, metric sistem ve uzunluk ölçüleri ya da ağırlık e, ölçüyle ilgili bir çalışmamız var. Okay, now let's see our workbook. And again, unit 8 at the library, e, sayfa 54'ten başlıyor workbookumuzda. Gördüğünüz gibi yine bir diyalog tamamlama çalışması var. Ve ardından da diyalog tamamlama çalışmaları devam ediyor sayfa 55'te. Ve sayfa 56'da buradaki arkadaşların ne yaptığını yazıyoruz. Ve yine e, which one is Sarah, which one is Sarah çalışmaları var. Yine Hura yaptığımız ve bir okuma çalışması ve ardından yine küçük bir resimli gramer çalışması var sayfa 59'da ve son kısımda da yine metrik sistemle ilgili bir çalışma var ve son olarak da bir grammar review çalışmasıyla bu haftayı bitiriyoruz. So okay guys, thank you for watching and I'm going to see you in the next class. Stay at home and stay safe and don't forget to wash your hands. Bye. Are you doing anything after school? No? Why? I have to return some books. Do you want to come with me? Okay. I need to borrow some books. Wait, let me drop off these books first. All right. Take your time. Excuse me. I'd like to check out these books. Can I see your library card? Here you are. A. Listen and repeat, then act out with friends. Are you doing anything after school? No. Why? I have to return some books. Do you want to come with me? Okay. I need to borrow some books. Wait, let me drop off these books first. All right, take your time. Excuse me. I'd like to check out these books. Can I see your library card? Here you are. D. Listen and write the number, then act out. What are you doing in the library? 
I need to borrow something. But you don't like reading. You're right. I don't like books. Then what are you going to borrow? I'm going to borrow animation DVDs. Do you have a library card? No, I don't. Then you need to make one. Can I use your card? A. Listen and repeat. Then point and say. One. Carry the books. Two. Drink water. Three. Look for a book. Four. Talk to the librarian. Five. Use the computer. Six. Wait in line. Seven. Write a report. Eight. Wear headphones. B. Listen and repeat. Then ask and answer. One. Which one is Mary? She's the one who's looking for a book. Two. Which one is Linda? She's the one who's using the computer. Three. Which one is Ted? He's the one who's carrying the books. Four. Which one is Ben? He's the one who's wearing headphones. Five. Which one is Tina? She's the one who's writing a report. Six. Which one is Amy? She's the one who's waiting in line. Seven. Which one is Jason? He's the one who's talking to the librarian. Eight. Which one is Aaron? He's the one who's drinking water. Which one is Linda? Which one is Ted? Which one is Ben? Which one is Tina? Which one is Mary? Which one is Amy? Which one is Jason? Which one is Aaron? C. Listen and circle. Then point and say. One. Which one is Lisa? She's the one who's talking to the librarian. Two. Which one is Jeff? He's the one who's looking for a book. Three. Which one is Sarah? She's the one who's carrying the books. Four. Which one is David? He's the one who's using the computer. Five. Which one is Betty? She's the one who's wearing headphones. Six. Which one is Mark? He's the one who's waiting in line.
A. Look and listen, then choose and write. Library of Celsus. The Library of Celsus is one of the oldest library buildings in the world. It was built around AD 135 in the city of Ephesus in the ancient Roman Empire. Now the city is part of modern day Turkey. The Library of Celsus was a public library for the people of Ephesus, and it had more than 12,000 scrolls of texts. Even though much of the building is destroyed, tourists continue to visit the old library. It's interesting to imagine people reading the scrolls a long time ago. This is Yusuf, reporting from Turkey. A. Listen and answer. 1. What were they doing when it started to snow? 2. What did she buy at the market? 3. Which one is Ted? Four. Where was he when it started to rain? Metric system of measurement. Scientists around the world use the metric system of measurement. It is important in science that everyone is measuring things the same way. Otherwise, there would be a lot of confusion. The metric system has three basic units of measurement they are meter, liter, and gram. Length. A meter is the basic unit of length or distance. For shorter lengths, the millimeter or centimeter is used. For long distances, the kilometer is used. Volume. A liter is the basic unit for volume. For smaller volumes, the milliliter is used. Weight. A gram is the basic unit for weight. For heavier weights, the kilogram is used.